Good morning, everybody. It is Wednesday, and I am going to be doing a um, Why Wednesday. Um, so each Wednesday, I'm going to be talking about different um, reasons as to why I love doing my Mary Kay business and talking about and answering questions um, that some of you guys may have. So as you can see, I just got out of the shower, so I apologize for my wet hair. But um, I just wanted to let you guys know a little bit about me. Um, I am 35 years old. I've had five children, three in which are um, heaven babies, if that's maybe the term you may want to use. Um, two of them lived. I had three miscarriages. Um, before I started Mary Kay... Um, I was, and still am actually, a um, survivor of domestic violence. So when I found out that uh, Mary Kay has something called the Mary Kay Foundation and a little bit of everything that you know people order goes towards helping women that are in my that are in the situation I used to be in to have a safe place by donating um, millions of dollars every year to domestic violence shelters. Um, Mary Kay also gets together with the domestic violence shelters um, service providers to help out that way as well. And that's important to me because whenever I was going through that, I didn't have anywhere to go. I ended up homeless. Um, I survived all different kinds of abuse from pretty much every category. I was depressed. I had no self-esteem at all. I hated myself and I hated life. So fast forward to being um, with Mary Kay, I decided that I wanted to join because I needed a huge, huge change in my life. And as a result, since I've been with Mary Kay, I joined at the end of January of this year, right as this whole um, pandemic was starting to kick off. Um, and since I've been with them, I found inner strength that I never knew I had. I never realized I had any kind of strength. I found courage within myself. Um, since being with Mary Kay, I found um, some self-esteem. I don't think of myself as fat or worthless. I'm not hopeless anymore. And that's all because of the great sisterhood we have with Mary Kay. And because I know that by me doing what I need to do and doing my part, I am actually helping other women who are in the shoes that I was once in. And to me, that's very, very, very important. Um... I'm also real huge into making the planet a better, safer, cleaner place. So I also love the fact that Mary Kay, um, the the like corporate for Mary Kay, they um, they they do a lot of recycling. So like the tubes that have, for example, your four in one cleanser in it from Timewise Three D, the caps and stuff. From all of that, it gets recycled, which is amazing. So we have less landfill waste, which is awesome. I love it. Also, I survived breast cancer. So um, with that being said, I just wanted to let you guys know that every time you guys order from Mary Kay, not only are you guys hoping Mary Kay to be able to do not to donate millions of dollars every year to domestic violence shelters, but you are actually also, a portion of that also goes for cancer research for cancers that attack us women, such as um, breast cancer, uterine cancer, um, and that all goes to cancer research to help find a cure for all the cancers that us women are at risk of getting. And I really, really like that. I cried for probably three days, happy tears, whenever I found out that I am a part of an amazing company that will do anything in their power to empower their women, to um, help make this world a better place, to help with our health through things such as the research for cancer and all of that. I, I love it. I can't even begin to 
explain enough on why I love that aspect. Also, as a lot of you may know, um, I wanted to start my own business because on my own, it was going to be a traditional business with factories and warehouses and all of that because I wanted a Christian-based business to where we can pray for each other at the beginning of every shift. I wanted to start a business to where we can put our faith first and then we can focus on our families and as we're focusing on our families not only are we meeting our families needs but we can be there for them I wanted to be a part of a business this is why I wanted to start my own I wanted to be able to have parties and be able to give out like quarterly bonuses and stuff and and just help families that worked for me any way I could to help their lives become better but as I, you know, ventured on my journey and I had spent quite a few years on working on that for myself, a great friend of mine um, reached out to me because I made a simple comment on one of her very simple posts and she let me know, well, Heather, did you know that the core values at Mary Kay is faith first, family second, and career third? And I about fell out of my seat. And I said, you've got to be kidding me because that's exactly what I've been wanting to do. That means the world to me. What other company can you work for that allows you to incorporate things like that that mean the world to you? I've worked for several different companies through corporate America and other work from home companies. And I wasn't able to do that. They wanted me to push myself and be one of those really pushy salespeople that I can't stand um and with Mary Kay it's not like that it's seriously like five million percent different than anything I've ever done before and I love it um I'm actually working towards earning my first career car through Mary Kay and yes they do give you a career car depending on um certain requirements or goals for you to hit and I'm working really really hard on getting mine but whenever I say working hard I'm not talking about pushing sales that's not what I'm doing I'm actually leaning more and more on my faith especially now amid this whole coronavirus pandemic um so whenever I found that out I was so happy I cried I did I'm not gonna lie I'm a softie I cried I'm every bit as sensitive as I am strong and If I can do it, I know for a fact that so many of you that are going to be watching this video can do the same thing. Um, I joined Mary Kay at a time that most people would have deemed crazy, like completely crazy. Um, I joined Mary Kay and signed my independent beauty consultant agreement when my fiance was let go from his job. Yeah. And yeah, I was nervous, but I prayed on it and I gave it to to God, which is my higher power. And I listened to what he was guiding me to do. And it's been the best decision of my life that I could have possibly made. Um, my fiance was off work for about three weeks. So at that point, all we had coming in was my disability. And again, I get disability and I'm in the process of working myself off of disability because of dealing with the depression and stuff of the past. So, um, I've had a few parties that were just amazing. I met amazing, strong-willed women and I didn't have the parties to, seriously, I didn't have them to sell anything to them. Um, I had the parties because I just wanted to have a girl's night in and have a break away from all the demands and the responsibilities of life. So um, I found a lady that was um, that attends church I was attending to before this whole pandemic thing came about. And she really inspired me. And she inspired me because she lost her husband about two weeks before I walked up to her and asked her to please come over for a girls' night in. And she inspired me because of her strength. Um, She was married to him for like 20 years, if not longer, and she never gave up. And I still keep in touch with her, and she's 
doing amazingly well. Um, she's found peace within herself, and I pray for her. Um, that's another thing I love about doing Mary Kay and being a Mary Kay Independent Beauty Consultant because if there's a need out there, I am able to go and help with that need, if not completely fulfill that need. So if there's anybody who needs um, prayers for any reason, it doesn't matter what it is. If there's prayers, and there's always prayers, let me know. I'll do whatever I can to reach out to you and help you. Um, I pray for as many people as I possibly can. So that is my video today for my Why Wednesday. You guys have a great day, and I'll see you guys later. Much love.